Hello friends, again warm welcome after long back. Today we will discuss the rigor mortis in fishes. What is rigor mortis, its importance and how it is useful in the preservation of the fishes for in a good condition for a long time. As we know, Fish is an excellent source of protein, fat and carbohydrate. It also contains the vitamins and minerals. It is easily digestible by the human beings due to the low connective tissue, less carbohydrate and it is an ideal food for human beings which gives precious nutritious in low cost. So the fish is the most important but as we know the fish having a high amount of water content in its body, the muscle of the fish contain high percentage of moisture or water, hence it is a highly perishable fish as we know the many bacterial loads are present on the fish body, its cavity, abdominal cavity as well as in the digestive systems. When after death this microflora, this bacterial flora gets active and it decomposes or suddenly deteriorate the fish and it is unfit for human consumption. We already know about the many cases that the food poisoning due to the not proper preserving the we can observe in the situation in community due to the food poisoning of the fishes. So it is a good quality nutrient nutritious fish and it need to reach to the consumer in a good health condition that the main aim of this uh, preservation is to keep the fish to provide the fish to the consumer in a good quality as we know the landing centers is near about far away from the consumers and so there is a time required for transport and we have to preserve it you know using um, so many methods and many background knowledge we have to know for that in most of the preserving the fishes we have the one phenomena is there that is uh, rigor mortis we also need to know what is the rigor mortis it is mostly upon on in all of the animals which is occurring on the earth as after death each animal is undergo the process of rigor mortis as we know to preserve the fish we have to know the background knowledge scientific knowledge how the fish is uh, get contaminated also how it is get spoiled due to the so many activities that is enzymatic activities microbial activities as well as chemical activities which is the main cause of the fish spoilage we have to reduce it in this process when there is one phenomenon that is rigor mortis is a main important we have to study that after the death of animal animals undergo the process of the rigor mortis each animal on the earth it is undergo in this process that is rigor mortis and in this video we are going to discuss going to clear uh, the how the rigor mortis what is the rigor mortis and how it's occur in the fishes and the benefits this rigor mortis in the fish preservation let's move after death fish remain soft and fresh for five to seven hours after which fish becomes muscle fish muscles of the fish become stiff as we know the fish is a perishable commodity and it is uh, remains in a good condition for five to seven hours after the catch and it is uh, fit for human consumption after which the rigor mortis will be shot in a temperate region and arctic region it may be delayed due to the uh, lower temperature but in tropical region like in our earth or like in india it will uh, generally the fish uh, remains fresh and soft for 5 to 7 hours where the temperature of is normally 27 to 30 degrees celsius that is atmospheric temperature 
after which the muscles become stark that is the become starts to become stiff and rigid and that is the onset of the rigor mortis and rigor mortis is nothing but the the stiffness or rigidity of the muscles is called as a rigor mortis it lasts for several hours it lasts for few hours to um, few days also depending upon the condition and where we have kept the fish and rigor mortis is a phenomena which defines the stiffness of the muscles occur of the animal following the death after the death it is nothing but the phenomena in which the stiffness of the muscles or rigidity of the muscles occur after death is called as a rigor mortis after the death of animal the oxygen supply to the body is ceases and fish dies due to the suffocation the main reason of dying of fish is after catching is the suffocation due to the oxygen supply ceases during rigor mortis the fish is regarded as a fish and fit for human consumption it's the main important during rigor mortis the fish is regarded as a fresh and fit for human consumption that is the its quality that is nutrient content and other uh, protein fat and carbohydrate as well as the vitamins and minerals are in a good condition so the fish is uh, fit for human consumption and during rigor mortis the body becomes stiff mouth opens and upper quilla spreads out as we know the fish muscle become tight mouth slightly opens body becomes rigid and this is uh, upper quilla which is a uh, frayed out from the body so this is the uh, condition of the rigor mortis mostly starts after 5 to 7 hours and it lasts for few hours to few days also and if the rigor mortis stage is delayed for longer period then the fish is uh, preserved or it is a fit for human consumption and our aim is how to prolong the rigor mortis is our aim after the rigor mortis decomposition of the body starts rapidly and the become fish becomes soft flabby foul smelling and unfit for human consumption as rigor mortis over and fish rapidly start to decomposing due to the microbial action and all other action and fish becomes soft flabby and foul smelling and it is uh, this stage it is not uh, unfit for human consumption that is unfit for human consumption the stiffness of the muscle during rigor mortis is mainly due to the absence of atp from the muscles which remains in sustained contracted state for a long time this is toughness is mostly due to the the presence of the atps in the muscles soon after the, the glycogen of the muscle undergoes glycolysis producing lactic acid in the absence of oxygen which accomplished by the fall in the pH has glycogen undergoes glycolysis and lactic acid is produced and this lac produced lactic acid reduces the pH of the muscles body fish muscles the amount of lactic acid depends upon the glycogen reserves this reduces the pH of the muscles if the glycogen content at the time of death then the lactic acid production will be more and the fall in the pH also more the creatine phosphate of the muscles is a lost the muscles remain stiff and unable to relax also atp as well as the creatine phosphate is also responsible for the stiffness of the muscles it has been found that the acidity due to this lactic acid formed during the rigor mortis due to the glycolysis is a bactericidal as it is a bactericidal it helps to prolongation of rigors 
as microbial activity in the low pH uh, that the acidic pH is uh, delayed and they cannot they it is unable to digest that the prolongation of rigor vitae that is the uh, rigor mortis period it is prolonged or it is enlarged for few hours to two days in the species which is rigor mortis appears early it is a shorter duration but if it is delayed it contains last for longer periods means if rigor mortis starts earlier it will finish earlier and it also not prolong so far if the rigor mortis is a longer period and it is start after delayed in then the the rigor mortis process is of prolonged period that is the preservation or good condition period of the fish is higher time now we will discuss the rigor mortis is depends on that is uh, onset of rigor mortis as well as the finish of the rigor mortis and prolongation of the rigor mortis is mostly depends on the fish species their glycogen content or nutrient content is a main important depending on the species higher the glycogen content in the muscle of the fish at the time of capture which delays the onset of the rigor mortis then manner of catching the fish how the fish is captured if the fish is captured and it is a death of the fish occur by um, mostly suddenly death occur or it death occur by exhausted it is exhausted for 3 4 hours sometimes the some nets are like that that the gill nets the fish are entangled in gill in midnight and we remove the fish in early morning meanwhile the fish is uh, waste his energy by to escape from this net and he is lost his energy and this energy loss is also uh, one phenomena responsible for the start early uh, uh, rigor stage of the rigor mortis that is the many manner of catching is that the method of catching method of fishing is the most important and how its fish dies after death in mostly in aquaculture that prawns kept by the harvested by the nets or uh, after full drain suddenly these prawns are kept in a chilled water so the fish can die suddenly without uh, energy loss without existed uh, while uh, dying this is the main important also the rigor mortis depends upon the temperature at which we can keep the fish if the lower the temperature the onset and prolongation of the rigor mortis is uh, higher time frame then slaughter slaughtering stress also is important how the fish is uh, responsible or behaving to this stress the biological status of the fish and temperature of pre rigor storage pre rigor storage temperature we also we have to consider in this stage this uh, temperature pre rigor also in or during the rigor and the temperature is most important even when fish are killed under same condition they can be high variation in time of onset of rigor mortis depending upon the nutrient content glycogen content capturing methods and these are the some uh, important criteria we have to consider to prolong the or to onset the rigor mortis and prolong the rigor mortis so the fish our fish is in good condition it is uh, good for human consumption which preserve the good qualities of nutrients in it without deterring it thus the friends here we discuss the what is the importance of the rigor mortis in the fishes if you like this video please subscribe share and promote the channels thank you